Hello Capricorn, this is your reading for the 4th through the 5th. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. Let's see what's going on for Capricorn. What's going on for my Capricorns today? Please show me what's going on for Capricorn. Capricorn. Mm. I want to start new. Passionate about something here. Um, extending an offer to someone to start something new with them or starting a new business um, moving forward feeling like this would be something that would um, bring you success maybe this is with a business because you know the the chariot um, you know it's like doing what you feel like is best for you was going to bring you success so this may be like um, uh, some sort of endeavor that you guys are embarking on that you feel like uh, is going to like be good for me okay kind of reflecting on that moving forward cancer energy there hmm some disappointment around you guys Aquarius energy thinking about something that you started that you felt like was going to be successful but kind of like um, I think you're feeling kind of unsure about it right now feeling like things are not going to work out the way that you wanted it to yeah maybe you've received some communication from somebody um, that really you know hurt you that really hurt you mm -hmm. and a lot of you are just wanting to like get over it you know I'm what I'm getting here is that this three of swords energy this feeling of disappointment and heartbreak heartache is like it is something that has happened before but I think it, it still kind of creeps, you know, in, into your mind at times. Um, it's like there's something here that was very hard for you to deal with. Maybe somebody moved away from you. Maybe you had a love that, um, you know, maybe they took another job somewhere. Uh, or somebody moved on from you, feeling like they couldn't, you know, do this anymore. Something like that where, you know, there there's a separation energy here of um, distance, of uh, communication here, okay? The Magician. Yeah, before you guys, I felt felt very confident that um, whatever it was that you started was going to bring you success. You you actually like were manifesting, um, you know, good things into your life, and I and I feel like you still are. But I I get that whatever has hurt you before, it still kind of like presents itself, and you may feel like at you know a very inopportune time, but. Um, you know, there. If you address your feelings here um, and go with it, you can get through this. You can get through this. You can push through this. Okay, for sure. Now, what I'm getting for others of you is that there, there's somebody else that um, feels like they want to manifest something with you. They want something with you, feeling like they're willing to, um, they're willing to do whatever they need to do to have this. Um, successful relationship with you somebody that was also very heartbroken here okay yeah this two of cups oh yeah yeah you know for a lot of you guys um there there's somebody that you shared um a relationship with and it went downhill pretty fast um, but there was a lot of love between the two of you there is a lot of love between the two of you um, somebody is, is feeling very um, affected by this right now okay and they're being flooded with love and emotions right now feeling heartbroken that you guys are not together, wanting to be together, wanting to do whatever they can um, to bring this back. Want to do whatever they can to bring this back. They're feeling very, they're feeling burdened right now because you guys are not together. 
wanting to communicate with you. Maybe they have. Maybe you guys have blocked them. But, um, oh my goodness. Uh, this is this is kind of heartbreaking because you know this energy is like somebody who you were with before um, they broke your heart they broke your heart and you love this person you felt very attracted to them you thought you guys were gonna you know have this successful relationship something happened between the two of you here with this three of swords energy and this person moved away okay whether you guys stop communicating or whether um, they physically moved away okay but you know you manifested a new start for yourself somewhere else okay and whatever went on between the two of you you were carrying this burden by yourself for a long time but that is no longer because this person is very in love with you okay if you felt like they they weren't or that they don't they do now they're willing to carry the burden they're willing to do whatever they need to do to manifest a new beginning with you guys okay or vice versa this can be um, you feeling this way as well Capricorn eight of swords energy um, Gemini energy here Gemini Sagittarius um, cancer energy is present here. Wow. Hmm. But you guys, I feel like, you know, I think you kind of expect this person to come back, but I don't think you are comfortable letting this person back in because you did feel like you were carrying the relationship by yourself. Yeah, a lot of conflict here. A lot of conflict here with this person. A lot of arguments, a lot of fighting. Um, and I feel like, you know, you guys probably took a lot of the responsibility of, like, the relationship when you were together. Maybe even if you knew that you weren't wrong, maybe you took that, that blame just so you guys could still be together. Somebody's working hard, trying to um, get back into your good graces. Maybe this person has contacted you, and um, but maybe they haven't, because here they are with the Eight of Swords, you know, thinking very heavily about how to make this, how to make this happen, how to make this happen. Hmm. Yeah, like I said, wanting to collaborate, wanting to work with you, wanting to compromise on the things that um, they weren't willing to compromise on before. Um, this is your card, Capricorn. Maybe you guys were the ones that, you know, walked away before here. Maybe not. You know, it could be the other person. And I have to keep saying that because, you know, it's just the energy that I see here. That somebody moved on. Somebody moved on. They were very heartbroken. I feel like one of you moved on physically first and the other one was just forced to leave it behind because, you know, you had no other choice. But there's somebody that is willing to, like revisit the situation really willing to take on whatever responsibility is necessary to bring this connection back together here worrying themselves into a tizzy really with the eight of swords and the five of wands like you know fighting with themselves can i do this will they take me back they won't take me back maybe i worried them too much before you know that sort of thing um but at the end of the day you know wanting to wanting to compromise and work things out here okay so again we have gemini leo cancer energy sagittarius um aquarius energy maybe um yeah hmm. but anyway that is what i have for you guys and um i'll be speaking with you soon